The Pioneer Valley Transit Authority will soon have more electric vehicles thanks to a $54 million grant from the Federal Transit Administration. 22 News reporter Kate Wilkinson is live in the newsroom with a breakdown of how the funds will be used. This will take four diesel fueled buses off the road and replace them with new electric ones, but it will also help set the PVTA up for further electrifying their fleet down the road. Luis from Springfield was excited to hear more buses on the road will soon be electric. Pretty much I'm doing everything by the bus right now. I'm going shopping, going to the mall, you know, wherever I got to go. Currently, there are 12 electric buses. This will add four more, as well as 20 of these electric charging stations. This will al allow us to convert or accommodate the conversion of the fleet to a fully electric battery electric buses. PVTA Administrator Sandra Sheehan said they're hoping to order the buses in the spring. They're also receiving a 20% match from the state's Department of Transportation, putting them on the path to improve air quality and reduce emissions by 2050. A balanced approach as we try to continue to move and it fits right into the plan that Pat Sullivan and I have done for the city of Springfield, 25% reduction. Funds will also go towards training employees how to use the electric vehicles, which don't require the typical maintenance diesel fueled buses need like oil changes. But electrifying these buses is a big, big achievement and it came about because of President Biden's infrastructure bill. They also plan to upgrade the bus bays and maintenance facilities at UMass Amherst using that funding. We're we'll you live in the newsroom, Kate Wilkinson, 22 News.